Okay, so here's your champion generator. Oh, this is a smaller, uh, smaller size the champion generator. And so what it was doing, it was uh, it was cutting out, and then uh, finally it wouldn't start. So what I did was simply prime, uh, clean out the. The float bowl, it's a 2000 watt inverter, sport power, and uh, so basically all I did, oh man, these have these uh, these gas caps, they're sort of, sort of uh, tricky, uh, these gas caps have to be turned on in order to vent properly, if they're turned off, they won't work uh, they'll create a vacuum inside the gas tank and will not allow the gas to flow into the carburetor. So this has a little switch on it here. Off on switch right there. You need to make sure that's on and just to be safe you might want to you know check it with some sort of vacuum device similar to uh, a radiator vacuum. That one also has a filter in there. It's pretty cool. And so if you're not moving around you suspect the uh, cap um, champion is pretty good about customer service. So actually what I did to this one basically uh, I pulled the air cleaner off, uh, or part of the air cleaner here, and then simply uh, primed the carburetor, and that's all I had to do. Uh, this little top part here is to access the, the spark plug, and we had spark there, and so I just simply, you might be able to get by with some starting fluid and not have to mess with any of that other stuff but wait basically what I did was I just filled a small uh, nozzle uh, bottle and fed it up through the carburetor uh, line there actually you can access the carburetor here too as well there's a vent but basically I just squirted a few drops of fuel up into the carburetor uh, manifold and away we go. And so this is this is actually your bleeder for the carburetor and you can turn this screw and bleed it. If there's debris or something in there you'll find out pretty quick gunk starts coming out. And actually that's where I got my gas for my primer. I just bled the float bowl and away we went. So at this point you uh, again you want to make sure your fuel cap is on uh, the engine power is on. Now this is the gas flow so you want to make sure you got the gas flow on and it should fire up. Yeah.